Ayo, hey. Jojo. Episode 15 live reaction, I'm pretty sure. Let me double check. And, um, yeah, we are on kissanime.com. If y'all want to watch alongside with me, which, since you guys can't see it and you want to know what I'm reacting to, that's, that's what I suggest you do. Um,. So yeah, uh, I'll let y'all know when the uh, actual episode starts. Like it's always a little intro in the beginning, so I'm gonna watch that first. Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah, this is also uh episode fifteen. I never uploaded my other JoJo reaction. Oh yeah, right here. All right, fast forward past this part. No, 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 no. Long, it's long as intro for this damn show. the intro all right get animated.com jojo uh season one um chapter 15 here was proof one minute 50 seconds in three two one boom season do his bubble attack This couldn't be great. He's a nuisance, but at least his hormone works. You're surrounded by my bubbles. Here's the bombardment. No. Okay, he's using some clothes items. Wow, he popped all the bubbles. Those wires on his head didn't pop my bubbles. It was the wind they created. That means those wires are anti hamon weapons. They know the principles of hamon. They met with hamon before, over 2,000 years ago. What is happening to the air around them? No, see, they get down. What the? He got cut. How is he getting cut? Close your eyes. That wasn't just a wind. It was an after effect of a vortex. Damn, what the hell? How the hell speed back in all this? The Hamon tribe. I thought we eliminated them all. Oh, they thought they wiped out the people who made this shit. But they were in wrong way for us to awaken. Damn you. You killed my dear friend. You think losing an eye will stop me? Oh, he for real lost an eye. Are they laughing at this nigga like he a joke? The Hamon tribe always say the same thing. It was the same when we crossed from the western continent as it is now. You think losing an arm or an eye will stop me? I do you take my friend's life? No, oh, same shit. That's why we laugh. It's the same shit. Monsters. Let's go. Go find the stone. Mm -hmm. You're running away. Bro, they letting you live? That's crazy. Ooh, shit. Your throat and lungs are your weak points. We know that if you can't breathe, you can't use hormone. That quick. Nah, I say whatever. I always said, come face me again when you are stronger, boy. Wow, he letting them live. Plop. When we meet again, I want to admire your strength. Before I utterly destroy you. Got curve stomp.
It seems there are no other harmonies. Let's move. Joseph ain't gonna do nothing. No, he always got a little plan. There you go. <laughs> I love this dude, man. He always got some plan, man. What Joseph gonna do? He's gonna get courage stumped too. I take care of this. Three on one? Right. It's time to show off my brand new technique. I he did say he wanted something better than the bubble lancer too though. Nani? Let me introduce myself. I'm Joseph Joe Star, the guy who mopped the floor with your buddy. Santana. I call this the Hamon Clacker Volley. Start off by filling these clackers with Hamon. Why would you tell them? Okay. This goofy motherfucker hit himself in the head. That's a distraction, though. It's Joseph. It's either you mourn the loss of your friend. If I feel your pain and anger. But more than that, I can't stand egotistical jerks like these guys. I'm not an expert yet, but see what you think of my volley, my clacker volley. He dropped them on purpose too. Now like he got four. I hate to say it, but my home is still weak. But I can use these steel clackers to break your skin and feed with home on. That's even my handicap. Pretty good job, right? Take this. Let's go. This is absurd. Perhaps humans have regressed over <laughs> Dale. <clears throat> regressed. No, that's a part of his plan. Perhaps so. Stop making monkeying around. You just toss another ball at them. Jojo might be serious. He'd be fine if he was facing a street punk. But these guys are way out of his league. It's silly enough to make me. <laughs> Damn. Blasting nobody here take you seriously. Hold it, big guy. You're going to get hit. Don't. Human lives are short enough. Do not do not rush to die. Spaghetti, uh, what the heck? Looks bad, but it's a real threat. You need to try my clocker volley before you judge it. Like I said, that was part of his plan. He always got some little trick up his sleeve. The clocker's vanished. I've been working on the railroad all the... What the hell? I have to steal food. If you don't get it, let me show you. Wow, he contorted his, he changed his body so that he don't get hit. Look at the speed. Fashion and Santana. The clocker didn't even touch him. Wow. I admire your weapon, courage, and idea. Did he see through him? This is becoming fun. Oh, I thought they regressed, though. I give you one minute. I bestow on you a single minute to fight the mighty Wamu. He cut Jojo's wrist. As you see, I've cut your wrist. You're going to give you one minute of conscience to stop the bleeding. Give me everything you've got. Come on. Here's what I say to the Hamon tribe. Whole lot of spearing going on. Here's an hourglass measure in blood. I move we build side. Boy, go pick up your weapon. Huh? What was that you said? Go pick up your weapon. Is that what you said? I don't need to do that. There's no need to go pick it up. What the fuck? He hit him in the head. That's not going to kill him, though. 
That was my clacker boomerang. One minute is all I needed to need to end you. Make fun of me, will you? I smash you to pieces. His face not even ripping apart though. Very well. Hit me all you like. You are the first person to scar my face. And so I bestow upon you this honor before you die. How is he talking shit with like a piece of his face missing, bro? You sure you say no one has ever hit your face before. Big words. You didn't even notice when you killed Mark. I make you regret holding your nose so high. Look out, he's up to something. That arm of his isn't broken. Wow, speed wagon. He getting bigger? This is going to be bad. It was wise of you to jump back. I let you hit me to punish myself for my lack of caution. Let your guard down. But that has ended. Finish him now. Here's my technique. The divine sandstorm. I'm in trouble. He spin his left arm clockwise. His right arm counterclockwise. Dojo is caught unaware while moves fit seem to grow before his eyes. The space between his fists become a destructive vacuum. The whirling creates a microism of wind and sand. Damn. He ripped through the marble pillar like a piece of old cloth. Real high winds. Damn. Clothes getting shredded. All that. He didn't even kill Jojo? That was my divine sandstorm. Oh, he cut him up pretty good. blood in my eye threw off my aim but it was enough even when you hid behind the pillar dead already originally I would ignore humans like yourselves I ain't letting them get stronger bro kill these motherfuckers but you witnessed my sin so I must be rid of you as well yeah alright kill them perhaps yourselves what the fuck wasn't well, he just getting up? I imagine things. Oh, there you go. Right in. Okay. Bro. I thought my man here was fucked up. How the hell is he? He healed and shit. Chill out. He laid back down. Dude, Joseph, bro. Oh, my God. He don't stop. I can't stand leaving me, but Mr. B-Wag, he's spotless. He got a plan. He always got a plan. Can't use Hamon. All that left is my specialty. All I can do is run. Look at our dismissal hero. Throw this on the ground. Forced to play dead. And he's about to be speed back to his fate. Even so, Jojo will remain worthy hero of this tale. Is this narrator? Here's why. This dude should have been walked away. Why is he still standing there? Coward, I thought you could trick me and escape. What the fuck? Can he just jump off? I just wanted to get this mine cart. So only act like a coward to lure me over and let your friends escape in. And you fell for another of my tricks. Get out of here now, old man. You too. Curious bastard. I'm sh sure I painted myself into a corner. I need to come up with something. Can I get a break? Why the fuck is this dude just sitting there? Kill him! An unbidden hero only when Jojo loses the will to fight will he lose his status as a hero. This is the narrator talking. Wow. Oh, 
okay, Caesar just wiped his face and all the blood and shit just don't matter no more. What the hell is going on? You should be quite brass for one in such a terrible state. Jump off the damn train, bro. What is this dude doing? Pretty sure he can handle it. How are you so tough? Don't you have bricks for brains or do you have another trick for me? Why are you allowing him the opportunity? You want to know? Don't tell me. It is something stupid like going into the mine and using explosives on me. Oh no, he knows. Or do you plan to pull the brake and send a minecart flying? He knows about that too. Something like this. I mean, all you do is predict shit, Jojo, so. Him predicting something is not new. I'm your wristwatch is almost up. There's no chance you'll survive this. Get it? I just kill you. Don't even all this talking. I give you. I give. If you give me a month, I'll become strong enough to beat you, bro. What the fuck? Give me a month, and I'll outdo you. I'm the first person to scar your face. Good point. If I put my mind to it, my potential is limitless. No, never mind what I said. Kill me. Well. Finish me quickly. It's an hour to be killed by a warrior like you. Mm -hmm. Make a penis while I move. I told you to continue. Got in his head. Carry the shame of being scarred by a human. The only way to fix that is by beating me in a fair fight after I've trained. Mm -hmm. What? Don't feed me your lies. I've hooked him just a bit more. He called me a car when I ran. I'm using a word like that means he's the proud warrior type. Use that against him. I'm rather new to fighting. But if I train with Hamo for a month, I know I have the talent to beat you. I was the first human to hit your head, and I've carved a hunk out of it. Wordplay go crazy. But you have a chance to kill me before I grow into a real threat to you. Get to him. Heavy. Why you? Oh, look, his people right there. His men is up. Why did you let him live? Exactly. Crap, we got company. What the fuck? He's ate a bomb. A grown finer is wilder of Hamon. I got him. Jojo. I agree to your proposition. You said you'd be stronger in a month, so I would give you a month to live. How you gonna find him, Goofy? You won't kill me? That's right. We'll fight again. That's right. This is a bad idea. You'll regret it. However, I need to ensure that you will not simply run away. Why won't we use that old thing again? The wedding ring of death. I will put this around your Arota. The ring will start to dissolve in 33 days. Inside is a 
relent poison. The ring cannot be removed. Any attempt will break it, releasing the poison. You have only one way to avoid the poison. Fight and defeat me within 33 days and take the antidote from my lip ring. Hmm. To the death do us apart. <laughs> a true wedding ring. Midnight, 33 days at the Coliseum. I'll be waiting. You guess wrong if you thought you escaped. I don't imagine we'll fight, but here's a little gift. I'll put it around your windpipe. Mine is a different poison from Wamu's. Enter those in my nose ring. Cars? Nonsense. We are immortal. What is the point of the rare thing that gives our lives meaning? I can see why you do this, but our goal is to obtain the power of the red stone. Aja, do not forget that, you too. Let's go. Do to go stronger, overcome my divine sandstorm? Um, holy smokes. A wedding ring that's a black joke if I ever heard one. And now I've got two of them. Do I look like the big miss or something? Yeah. Well, at least people I can see that are safe. There's no nonsense. I'm open, I'm open about it. Are they going to finally work together now? Caesar and JoJo? Despite your blood loss, you pulled a blue card. Shark would be proud of. Good show. Let's study how more together. We'll grow stronger. You and me both. Oh my wa. Alright, it's an episode. Let's see next preview. Alright, I'll let that play out. Preview. Oh, here we go. Uh -oh. Like one more as a bluff. Step through these doors and you will see. I uh, should know. I won't hold back because you're a girl. Welcome to Venice. Lease. Lee. I'm on coach. What the fuck? You know, damn service. Um, anyways, though, episode was good. Real good. It's JoJo. I mean, come on, man. Come on, my. It's John, John, my. Anyway, that was real good. I really liked it. Uh, I do have a complaint, which is a couple points actually. Well, first one was you know Caesar Gnomes telling their abilities. The narrator could have said that. Um, the second complaint is these pillar men letting them live like. Bro, why would you let them get stronger to beat you? Stupid. That I mean, hey, that's how they drop these shows, though. You know, there's other ways to go about that. You know what I'm saying? Like, have them beat them to near death and to the point where, you know, you don't think that they did. I mean, you think that they did when they they not. You know what I mean? That would be a way to go about versus saying, well, I'll give you time to train and get stronger than me. Like, uh, it's just I can look past that because I actually like the show. These cool characters, cool abilities. It's looking good. So I can look past that. And um, next episode, like I said, they got a Hamon coach. Like, bro, what the hell? So, yeah, we'll see. Anyways, y'all, just hit them out. Peace.